Now let's get familiar with some important commands in the mailing tab. Click on the mailing tab. This ribbon will open up. To start mailing, go to the start mail merge group and click on the start mail merge command. When we click on this command, we will be able to see a list of options. Letters. This option is used when we want to prepare letters with the same text but addressed to different people. Email messages. This option is used when we want to send the same email to different email addresses. Envelopes. Once the letters are prepared, addressed to different people, we use the option of envelopes to prepare envelopes with these different names to whom the letters are addressed. Labels. This is used when we want to assign a label or title. Directories. This is used when we want to compile all the important words. While making the list of the recipients, we have to use the select recipient command in the group start mail merge. There are two options in this command. Type new list. Once we click on this option, a dialog box of new address list will open. We have to type the details of each recipient in the different fields given. Each time we have completed typing the details of a recipient, we have to click on new entry for the next one. Clicking on OK will save the list. Save it in My Documents in the folder My Data Source. The other option in the command Select Recipient is Use Existing List. Once you click on this option, you can select any previously saved list. Once the list is prepared, the Insert Merge Fields command is used to insert all required information of the recipients in the prepared letter. Once we click on this command, a list of all the fields will appear on the screen. We can select all the required fields for our letter. All these selected fields will then get inserted in the letter. Once all the required fields are inserted in the letter, we have to insert information of the people according to the selected fields and finally prepare the letters addressed to the different recipients. For this, we have to click on the finish and merge command. If we click on this command, we shall see three options. The first option is Edit Individual Document. With this option, we can prepare multiple letters addressed to all the people in the list from just one letter. By clicking on Edit Individual Document, the Merge to New Document dialog box will open and there will be several options. If we select the first option of all, then the letters will be prepared addressed to all the people in the list. If we select the option of current record, then the letters will be prepared addressed to the people in the new list. And if we select the from to option, all those people will be addressed who are given a serial number in the list. The second option in the finish and merge command is print documents. With this option, we can print copies of the same letter addressed to all the people in the list. And the third option is Send Email Messages. With this option, we can send the same email 
to all the email addresses saved in the list.